YouTube, this is Nerf Flag, coming with a review of my Nerf Zombie Strike Dreadbolt. As you can see that the Dreadbolt is a huge blaster. It comes with a green scope, but can be attached to any rail. It can't magnify or anything. It's just a see-through sight. The ammo takes us five big arrows, which you can store on the blaster for on the go. No, it's a blaster. The blaster itself is pretty much like a crossbow in real life. It has one tactical rail for the sight. No barrel extension point. No stock extension point and two slime mounts. I'll just go quick through sixty. It is a spring power blaster, meaning you have to reprint before you can fire again. On this side, it has a huge zombie strike logo. On the front, you may notice that there is a working mechanism how to load the blaster. I will now assemble the blaster in its full form. It is a personally my favorite zombie strike blaster so far because I love the walking dead. Now, <clears throat> to load the blaster, we have to pull this lever down until it can't go any further. The bow should be like this. Then you pick it up and you pick up, up an arrow and slaughter in. As you can see there, the, there should be a wee orange thing going on. Yep. We're going to do a fire. And yes, again, have cups stack for the operation. I like to point out that sometimes this does not fire. As you can see, that the dribble does have power on But, other than that, it's alright. I wouldn't really recommend this for inside because. Those big bow arms would probably smash into the door frame. Thanks for watching the video. Any like support, comments, and subs would be greatly appreciated. And we're gonna smash the button. Also, guys, this is gonna be the video for next week, which I'm posting today, Thursday. Because I will not be here on next week for the recording. Then we're for that. Out.